My presentation on ESMA EON's Digital Conference 2020 is about sexual function in young adults following a brain tumor diagnosis. From previous research, we know that sexual dysfunction is common in young adults after cancer treatment. However, there are few studies on sexual function in young adults with a brain tumor diagnosis. So therefore, in this study, we have compared sexual dysfunction in young adults with brain tumors to those with other cancers. And we also looked at um, if they had talked, if they had been given the opportunity to talk with a healthcare professional, pro professional about these issues. Participants for the study were identified through the national quality registers uh, 1,010 young adults completed the survey one and a half years after diagnosis and were included in the study. Of those, 123 were diagnosed with a brain tumor. Our results show that there are few differences regarding sexual dysfunction between young adults with brain tumors and those with other cancers. The young adults with um, brain tumors report as high numbers on sexual dysfunction as other cancers do. Over 40% of the men and over 50% of the young women report sexual dysfunction one and a half years after diagnosis. Yet only a minority, 20% of those diagnosed with a brain tumor could recall that they had talked to a healthcare professional about sexual issues. So there is a clear need to address these issues in, in clinical care routinely.